Hey, what's going on, guys? Jackson's Gaming 101 here, and today I am bringing you guys another tutorial video. I uh, haven't done one of these in a while. Last tutorial video I did was my first video, which was counting this video six episodes ago, or six videos ago. Um, this video is for huge FPS increasements for Rust. Um, if you guys haven't already, uh, go check out my new Rust videos that I've been putting up. Uh, a dual survival series with H. Nordloff. Um, and yeah, so let's get started. So for any of you guys that have been having uh, FPS lag in Rust, which is free uh, frames per second lag, which is basically just um, like choppy. If your game is really choppy, then this guide will be for you. Uh, this guide is by Jesus Freak. I'm giving him full credit. And yeah, you guys should go check him out. He's got some good Rust guides and some other good guides as well. So I'll leave the link to this guide in the description. So what you want to do is open up Rust and go to this guide and scroll down to these ratings. These, uh, it says order ascending, do not blah, 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 rating 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, what you want to do is copy this, as it says, right here, do not include the quotations. You just copy them, open up Rust. If you're a Mac user, hit FN F1. If you are a Windows user, just hit F1. And then hold Control, click V and click enter. Now the way that you can get this to work is to make sure that it gives you this message right here. Uh, blah 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 changed blank to blank boolean. Now the reason why I say blank to blank is because it can be true or false, false to true, true to true, false to false, doesn't matter. Um, as long as it says boolean and you're changing it to false from true to false, uh, that means that you changed it, which helped it lag less. And basically, you just want to individually go through all of these and do the same. And for certain ones of these, where it has a number zero, you can change that from one to five. So for render level, you can make that one to five. For terrain, you can make that one to five. Grass, you can make that one to five. It doesn't matter, um, and you can make that make that anything. Make that any number through one to five. Uh, zero will obviously make it lag the least, and five will decrease it at a minimum. Now, uh, they this is also being constantly updated. As you can see, this was updated on the sixteenth, which was a while ago, but uh, it does show that he's recently updated it. So he's still going to be updating as the game updates. And as you scroll down here, you see these launch parameters. Now these launch parameters are giant FPS increases, like really big. Like I could run just one of these and I wouldn't have to run any of these unless I was recording to make it lag less. Um, so basically what you do is you just copy this, quit Rust, open up Steam, Go to Rust, click Properties, Set Launch Parameters, and then you just copy and paste that, click OK, click Close, and then open it. And then when you open it, it'll plug in this, and it'll increase your frames per second a lot more. Thanks guys for watching! Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe. If this worked for you guys, make sure to leave a like and a comment. If it didn't, leave a comment telling me what the problem was, and I'll try to help you guys get it fixed. Um, make sure to visit Jesus Freak's Steam Guide and uh, tell him that I sent you. Tell him if it worked. Leave a rating for it, uh, his guide. Always leave a five-star if it worked. And thanks for watching. Bye.